Hi everyone, this is Steve of Mr. Jen All in One. How are you guys doing today? Today I'm doing a very interesting episode. It's kind of like a vlog plus an unboxing and a review video. Um, what I'm going to review unboxing and vlog is the Guild Warehouse. It happened in June 13. I learned a lot of new techniques, how to shop, and very short amount of time. And um, I can't wait to show you, so let's get started. I was so lucky enough to get a VIP list for the Gale Warehouse sales. And for those of you who are familiar with Gale, it's actually an online shopping website and they carry all the designer brands. They carry men's, men's wear, men's, women's wear, fragrance, beauty, lifestyle, vacation, anything you name it, they have it. And online sales usually is about 50% off. So for the warehouse sale, basically everything in the warehouse is up to 90% percent oh my god i was freaking out because i was thinking if i if i see something like a five thousand dollar i like and after 90 percent it's only five hundred dollars i have to be there so my invitation said that please be there by six o'clock and there's two days six uh march i'm uh, sorry there are two day of sale in la june 13 and june 14 and they have a time slot so for the vip night which is the first night and they have from 6 o'clock to 9 o'clock in Los Angeles. So me and my partner was there around 4.30 I think. And at 4.30 I was a, there was about 10 people in front of us, front of us which is not bad. I thought it was going to be way more than that. And I realized that the warehouse is actually not that big. So it's pretty small. Anyway, um, so you can see the video I'm showing right now. There's a lot of people there. And it's a little overwhelming that when you first go into the warehouse sale, it's like I hate to say this, it really they really devalue the product because they just pile everything on the table and it, it looks like I hate to say it, it looks kinda like the stuff nobody wants. But they are designer stuff, so it's very interesting, very weird. So I quickly went to the handbag because I kinda know what I want and I was glanced through the table real quick and then the only real designer that I saw it's the YSL which is the here. It's the YSL monogram uh, push it it's the clutch handbag and um so i saw this i said okay well i'm just gonna put it in my bag so they actually give you a little black shopping bag it's kind of ghetto so i just dumped this i pretty much dumped this bag in the bag it's really ghetto and i was continuing shopping and i'll go back to this bag it's really interesting so i was walking i knew i need a shoes i need a new pair of shoes and um so i, I as you can see there's there's a lot a lot of shoes on the table so i quickly learned that Two things you need to do number one figure out where is your size and the second thing is look for the designer box so i found my size and i saw designer box and i, I saw jimmy choo i mean it's very noticeable let me show you you see this box there it's jimmy choo everybody know that's why i just grabbed the box real quick and there's only a few of this and my size and i pull out it's actually a really cute shoes from jimmy choo i believe this is actually last year's model last year's spring because i saw this at nemo one time I didn't buy it because it's too expensive and the original price of about $450 ish I forgot it's on the tag and then but I only pay for $135 can you believe this $135 I mean I have to say that though $135 is actually really really good deal so I just went ahead to get this so my, my tip for you is that when you're shopping for shoes at the warehouse sale figure out your own size what size you wear and one more up you, because for men you can always wear one size up that's okay because just wear thicker socks that's fine so that give you a double chance to get what you want and look for designer box and uh, you saw this on the box, you pull it out, you take a look, you like it. Even though you're thinking about it, I would just recommend you pull it and then otherwise it will become just like that, that fast. When I dress myself, I know how much money I have and I really can't afford to buy designer clothing, designer shoes, designer handbag, everything, everything designer. So I typically just buy a Zara suit. For men, I think that's perfect because they're European and they cut European size so it fits very nicely and all you need is a, a designer accessory such as shoes um, or just a bell sometimes or handbag that instantly upgrade your look so that's normally how, what I wear it's usually Zara, shoe, Zara clothing but I wear designer shoes and designer handbag to mismatch a little bit
So I was thinking, oh my God, this look kind of used. I don't know if I like it. I mean, I mean, thank God the white um, Saint Laurent is at the YSA logo is actually silver. If it's a gold, I won't even bother go there because it's thing too curly. I like how this you can just hold it like that. It's very easy to use. And I always want to look clutch like this, but it's a little too big for me, I think. But I thought it was only three. How much is it? 325 and did you know the regional price of this baby it's a one thousand seventy three dollar and twenty five cents so they were over there for only 325 the funny thing is that when I pulled this out register everybody stopped seriously just stop what they were doing they go oh my god how did you find this bed there's only one I was like oh really I just I just say I just saw it on the table and I grab it, that's it. So then I realized it's a big deal. And there was even one lady so cute, she said, I'll buy it from you. I'm like, uh-uh, if there's only one, this is mine. I don't care I'm gonna use it or not. Even sitting in my closet, I'll be happy too. Anyway, so I got this, this is a really good deal. So overall, I think that, um, I, I need to be honest with you, it's not what I usually like to shop. Uh, personally, I like to take my time and select the product I really enjoy and try on to make sure that I invest the money properly. I do feel like at the warehouse sale, doesn't matter if it's a guild warehouse. I know sometimes Barney's New York has a warehouse sale too. It's kind of like a, I hate to say this word, kind of like a high-end swami. And it's all about how fast you can get in there, how many products you can grab in your, in your bag, and then you figure out do you want it or not. And I just feel like, I don't know, it's not really I like it, but I do need to tell you this is really interesting that when the moment I pull out this YSL, YSL bag um, um, clutch, the lady was like, oh, everyone's, oh my God. It made me feel like, yes, I got something really good deal. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Mr. Jen all in one shopping with me at a warehouse sale, designer warehouse sale. And uh, please don't forget to subscribe Mr. Jen all in one on my YouTube channel and share my video on all your social media. I really, really appreciate that. I kind of like this now. Do you like it? Oh, by the way, let me know how do you like this bag. Just give me a comment right there. Nah or yes. Okay. <laughs>